Hey, uh, welcome to a nothingness, nothing. Um, it is a, another fan mail uh, unboxing uh, anthrax challenge that we're going to do here today. We got a lot of stuff that has come in, and so I want to crack it open in front of you guys so you can be a part of what goes on here. And this is, well, this is a Reeves blade. This was made by some man named Reeves out there, and we'll put a, a link for his blades out there so if you want to get a Reeves blade. And this thing, I mean, this this will definitely change the game up if you need to change it up. Here we go right here. This is a, oh, this is a beautiful hitter right here that came in. Look at that, huh? What is that? Look at that. Oh, that's that burger shirt, boy. That's a savage burger shirt. So even if you can't, you know, I'm on paleos right now. I can eat bur I can eat some burgers, but sometimes, you know, you can have a burger and wear a burger. So that's pretty beautiful. I want to thank whoever sent that in, and it doesn't say who sent it in. But that is the AWD hooded sweatshirt, and that's that burger shirt. So if we can find a link to that, we will put it down below. Uh, what else we got? Let's crack into something else. Package number two right here, and this is a really quality packaging, but not... This packaging ain't strong enough for this Reeves blade. You know, that's a straight up, I'll get a job in Santa's workshop doing it like that. Oh, and here's something we got that got sent in right here. And this is probably from some dang, I'm guessing, pediophile. Uh, and that's probably low key obvious. Let me see who this is. Oh, T Public. This is a company that makes cool stuff, T Public. And this is another little thing they have, like a booklet. Oh, so what they do is they create stuff for like different podcasts and different things. So if you want to be a supporter, and then they they were just sending me some merchandise that this is the kind of stuff they can make. Uh, if they want to put you if you want to put your logo on something or or do something like that. So um that was nice of them. No card, but we, we don't need a card. But anyway, that was something nice from them, from T Public. What else we got here? I want to thank whoever sent that in as well. Probably Daniel T Public sent that hitter in. And this right here, they used to give you, if you got uh, pornography, they put it in a black sack. So nobody would know what you had, but... If you got it at the service station, they put it in a black sack. But the problem was the dude that had the black sack always had pornography. That's what it was. So it really kind of backfired. Uh, this company called Entrepreneur. Um, oh, Entrepreneur. And they got a couple hitters right here. And so this is one right here, Entrepreneur. And if you are an Entrepreneur, then they got it. Entrepreneur Miami. So that's beautiful chest piece right there to something for your chest and stomach and arms and the tops of your arms on Turpiner. So thank you very much. It says, on behalf of Turpiner, I want to extend a very special thank you for your recent purchase. Uh, you are welcome. Um, they sent this in, but uh, you are still welcome. Let's see what else we got here. Ooh, what do you think it is? Dentures? Ooh, wonder what it is. Probably somebody's dick. I'm joking. Um, oh, this is a picture of a, a lovely lady here. This is Megan from New Jersey. And this is, oh, this cool sign that is on her property, I'm guessing. This is what Central Jersey looks like. It looks like a picture of almost something outside of a prison. Uh, but it's like a Robin Hood kind of sign, pretty cool. And then this jewel smoker. And this is to quit smoking. It's very sweet of her. So this is to help me quit smoking. Look, I got have different flavors in here. Um, chocolate mousse. 
what is that? Creme brulee, uh, bouillabaisse, base, which I don't even know what that is. That's soup and um, green. So there you go. Thank you very much, Megan. It's very kind of you. Uh, so glad you and Chris decided to get fan mail. I've been hoping to get an opportunity to tell you how much I appreciate TPW, which is hilarious, but in a particular, your honesty and openness about your struggles has helped me with my very own, which are similar, even though I'm like 10 years older than you and from a different part of the country. And I think by that term, she means that she's a female. Um, I think that means from, you know, v Vaginistan. I've had trouble with depression, anxiety, and low self-esteem since I was a kid. There's a family history of depression, and nobody says, but I'm pretty sure alcoholism, too. They get thirsty. Boy, de depressed people get thirsty. My husband, Matt, and I live in a small town in New Jersey with our three boys. He is from the Midwest, and we met while we were both living in New York City. He was working as a journalist, and I was a union organizer. Right after we got married, he transferred to Holland, which is a sauce, I thought. And I got pregnant with our oldest, who has now just turned 18. Matt and I spent most of our courtship in bars and have continued drinking and smoking whenever we are together. Except for when I was literally either pregnant or nursing. Um, let me see. Oh. My world's kind of collided when I met... When Matt and I went to see your stand-up a couple weeks ago, he has never heard the podcast but liked the Netflix special, so I told him about the show. We decided to make it one of our very rare date nights. Booked a room at the Holiday Inn and everything. I remember this. This is in Hasbrook Heights, New Jersey. I met you guys at the bar. That's why I remember you now. Oh, yeah. Um, Thank you, Megan. That's very sweet of you for this, and I'm glad that you and Matt... Uh, came out to the show. I remember meeting you guys and talking talking to you in the bar for a few minutes. Um, and yeah, and, and I'm, you know, maybe drinking is for you, maybe it isn't. Who knows? Maybe you have to take a break. Maybe you don't. Only you know if you have a problem with that. But I know that I, um, that I'm appreciative you sent these nice things. And thank you so much for this Jewel, Jewel E cigarette and for this photo of you. And uh, and we appreciate it. All right, let's see what else we have here. Ooh, this sounds like a puzzle. And if you sent somebody a puzzle, that means they have to put it together, dude. That's pretty messed up. That's a lot of work for someone. You know, especially when the picture's on the box. That's the thing about puzzles. The picture's on the freaking box, dude. So it's like the whole surprise is gone, I think. Let's see what this is, dude. What if this really is anthrax? Oh. Uh-oh. You are perfect exactly as you are. There is no need to change anything except the thoughts that you aren't good enough. Wow, that's a nice thing to say, huh? Um, I, thought you, I saw you a few years ago, first time in Fort Myers, Florida. I can't remember the year, but you were... Telling jokes about little people and cats. And that's a true story. I saw two cats attack a midget in Hermosa Beach. And that shit's been on my heart for a long time. I was hooked. You really made me laugh. I see comics a lot, and I'm all, not always impressed. I started to follow you on social media and got to see you last year in Pittsburgh and Cleveland. I am a registered nurse, 20 years. Oh, thank you for your, your services as an RN. I think nurses are some of the greatest people that we have in the world. Uh, 10 years in ER, and now I work for Cigna Insurance. Um, I love your honesty and your heart. Your humor is something I look forward to every week. Take care. Renee Nicole. Oh, that's sweet of you. Um, thank you, Renee. This is nice. You're perfect exactly as you are. There's no need to change anything except the thought that you aren't good enough. That's real facts right here. So let's get this. That Beaver, Pennsylvania. I think Renee's throwing out some uh, shots fired, huh? That beaver, that Jerry Mathers. Ooh, what is this? That Shootran shave cream, girl. You hit me with that Shootran, that stress away stick. Therapeutic grade essential oil, roll on. Ooh. Look at that, huh? Oh, yeah. Damn. 
Mmm. It smells like uh, rum and coke. Pretty good. Oh, a lot of treats in here. Look at this. That's Shutran soap bar. And that's, I'm sure, Persian. Look at these. A lot of these little baby hitters get some of that avocado. What is this? Oh, that mister, it says. Mr. Who? You know? So that's crazy. Lemon. Frankincense. Damn, this shit is b biblical. Thievery. Man, somebody's going to fuck me if I put all this on. Beaver Falls Coffee and Tea. Thank you very much. Coffee right here. Get that sack of cafe. And what is this? Oh, milk chocolate and dark chocolate. I'm on this paleo's diet right here, but we will keep these in studio as a gift for our guests when they come. Dove have good chocolates. And that's the truth, man, and people will tell you that. And what else do we have here? This pure nature, it's pure spa natural. Color changing LED enhances the ambiance in the room with soft glowing light. And this is a mist or two. This sprays mist into the air. So if you're tired of being in a room that doesn't have mist in it, then you could change your whole existence in minutes, it says. Present, prevents overheating and safety concerns because a lot of poor people get killed every year because they sleep by like space heaters that they plug into the wall. And that happens a lot of times, honestly, in Chicago. But thank you so much, Renee Nicole. That's really nice. This box of peace is what you sent me. This box of, of peacefulness. And a little bit of that beaver, huh? Throwing that Jerry Mathers out there. Thank you very much. This is a nice, nice gift. Very nice gift. Very thoughtful of you. And thank you for the note. And I bet if you got 40 chameleons or leopards or whatever you have that they really love you. You're a good owner. Let's see what this is right here. A shirt. There you go. Ooh, some man caught a, uh, some man caught a something in space. Jellyfish, I think. Wow. Can you imagine if they had a fish in space? What about a space shark? And so this is from T Public, uh, sending us something else. So that's really nice of them. All right, let's see what else we got here. This is from Kevin Best. And Kevin actually makes all of our T-shirts and stuff. So that's really cool. You can go to uh, uh, theovon.com slash store, and they have different all types of T-shirts and everything. And this is that Reeves blade right here getting us in. Getting us into the box. Let's see what Kev sent. Oh, nice. So we sent these bags. And so these bags are going to be uh, for people that that call in each month uh, with their This Past Weekend story. Um, and whoever wins each month, we're going to send them like T-shirt and some other things. And we'll put it in one of these bags each month. So I'm super glad that he sent us these. These aren't. Uh, these aren't for sale on the store, but those are for us to send our uh, gift bags out each month. Let's see what else. Anthony Hair Private Illustration. I think I opened this up before. And this says, Theo Von Podcasting. I hope this finds you well. I'm a huge fan of your comedy and overall way of being. You've helped me. Laughter really is medicine. By now, you've received my mustache cheeseburger hoodie. Oh. Mustache cheeseburger hoodie. He's a character I'm developing as part of a world of burgers and fried food called, called Burgers and Fries. Silly, but fun. Good luck with quitting the cigarettes, man. Anthony. Anthony. P.S. The P.I. stands for Private Illustrator. Ooh, Anthony Hare, P.I., and he's from uh, Canada, he's Canadian. So everything makes sense in Canada, you know. But thank you, we got that mustache cheeseburger, boy. That's what we used to call my stepdad, which is kind of funny. All right, let's see what else we got. I feel like uh, who's that guy, that math teacher that died? Stephen Hawking. All right, let me get... This next, and this is from 
Ellen Peebles. And she sent us some hitters right here. Thrive with me. Oh, wow. She sent that photog right there. Look like she just smoked a blunt, boy. And she lives down maybe in Delray Beach. You feel me? And this is um lifestyle. What is this? Sugar? Thrive. Ultra micronized nutrition. Thrive. Vanilla lifestyle mix. So if your lifestyle ain't right, get a fucking hit of that mix, boo. Fucking make a shake. You know what I'm saying? Have a couple of capsules. Make your children look different. Thrive. 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 Damn, they got everything in here, dude. You can't even get that vanilla lifestyle mix. Thrive with me. Thank you for sending these in. Um, I might try the mix. All right. And then we got this right here. This is from Brian James. And this is has glass in it. So we're going to be careful with that. Thank you, Miss Peebles, for that Thrive. And, uh... This is that Bud Vac, this says. Man, I'm going to cut my fucking arm open. All right. Ooh. What is it? Oh, here we go. Hope you can use these. They are useful for storing things. Oh, this is for pot marijuana addicts. All right. I hope you can use these. They're useful for storing things other than the green stuff. Oh, I use the, the large jar for marinades. Throw some chicken in there with some marinade. Vacuum out the air. Let it sit for about two minutes. Let the air back in. Then pump it again and let it sit for five to ten minutes. Release the vacuum and grill. It basically makes the meat absorb the juices faster than normal. Also, if you're into fancy coffee or weird shit, you can keep things a lot fresher in jars. Hmm. Um, let me know. Either way. So these are jars that are vacuum sealed so that they can, you can keep stuff better in jars. And he sent me a series of jars and they come with a pump that lets you pump out air that you don't want. Wow. Thank you. That's Bud Vac. So that could be for weed or anything. Marinade as well. What else do we have? I think we are done. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for the wonderful gifts and different things. And, you know, fancy vanilla mix and chocolate and shirts and, and doodads. And, um, and hopefully no anthrax. Some of my hands smell kind of weird. Thank you for this jewel. Thank you, Megan. Uh, you and Matt uh, for coming out in New Jersey to the show. And um, and just for all the cool gifts, we're gonna make like a montage and stuff around here in the studio as we get as we continue to get it to evolve, and uh, and just appreciate you guys' support so much. We'll um, I'm sure you'll be seeing some of these things up around the studio. Uh, I'll we'll put the the address if you want to send something in for the unboxing and for the um, anthrax challenge. I'm a little bit tired, so I'm gonna get out of here and try not to smoke. Uh, you guys have a good day.